What's up budget babes? It's Linda back again with another video. For today's Budget Babe Tuesday, I'm bringing you, you guessed it, another Dollar Tree haul. Obviously my favorite day of the week is Budget Babe Tuesday, so let's dive in and see what I got on this Dollar Tree visit. So let's get started with skincare. First, I'm going to show you an illuminating serum by OK. This is the brand OK, and I believe this is a Korean beauty product. I've heard pretty good things about this brand. Um, so let me know in the comments below if you've heard of this or if you like it or don't like it. This illuminating serum is one fluid ounce and it says that it has hyaluronic acid. Also claims to have vitamin B. So let's open this up and see what it looks like. Okay, so it is a Korean product. It says that it's made in Korea right here. It also says that it's cruelty free and vegan friendly. Let's test out the texture of this. So, wow, you see how thick that is? It retains its shape. Wow, okay, that looks amazing on the skin. It feels so soft. Definitely the way a serum should feel. Nice and hydrating and soft no fragrance so you know that's always good it claims to have all natural ingredients wow that feels so amazing and that was the only one i found oh my gosh i wish i would have found more because i definitely would have scooped them up this is amazing if you guys see the brand okay at your dollar tree definitely scoop it up at my dollar tree they had a whole selection of okay face masks i'm going to show you a clip now All of the masks looked beautiful, but two in particular caught my eye. So I got myself these masks by OK. I really like the idea of a three-step mask, so I got two. This one here says that it's suitable for daily use, detoxifies, and purifies the skin. So it looks like the first step here is a detoxifying cleanser. The second step right here is a purifying charcoal-infused sheet mask. And the third step is a moisturizing hyaluronic acid serum. I think these would be great for trips or just on-the-go beauty care. You can have a whole skincare routine in one nice, beautiful package. And this is the other three-step skincare set that I got, and it says this one is perfect for traveling and suitable for weekly use. So the other one said daily use. Step one is a deep cleaning foam cleanser, and step two is an exfoliating precision buffering pad, and step three is an oil controlling T-zone mask. So kind of gives you an idea of what that looks like and all of these so this looks really nice and I like that the back has all of the instructions ingredients and important information that you may need to know so let me zoom in and let you guys see what these look like Definitely a great find at the Dollar Tree. Next is nails. I only got one nail product for today's haul. I found some Sally Hansen nail polishes. They had a bunch of different colors, but this one is really the one that caught my eye because I don't really have a bright pink like this. I really like this type of color for the summer. And this is in the color Back to the Fuchsia, number 191. To give you an idea of the variety of Sally Hansen nail polishes, I'll show you a clip now. This was a great find because obviously it is a great name brand product that you can find at other retail stores and they obviously retail for more than a dollar. So definitely great value. Next items on our haul are going to be hair products. My first hair item was something that I was very excited to find. This is a L'Oreal Extraordinary Clay Dry Shampoo. This is what the package looks like. This is a four ounce spray bottle. I've never tried L'Oreal Dry Shampoo, but I'm excited to give it a try. This is also a name brand, and for a dollar, you can't beat that. Next in here, I found these great Con Air Pin and Hold Bobby Pin 
hair accessories. If you saw my last Dollar Tree haul, you saw that I purchased another set of Conair bobby pins, but they were the miniature ones, and these are the jumbo ones. Usually bobby pins are probably about that size, and these are the really big ones. So I'm hoping that maybe next time I'll find a normal size set of bobby pins because I have my minis and my jumbos. But Conair is a great brand. These are in the color black, and it is a 15 count of bobby pins. Very sturdy. Also in here, I found another easiest bun maker, but this one is for the half updo bun. If you saw one of my other hauls, you saw that I had the full size bun maker and it was the bigger one for a big top bun. This is for a half bun. I thought this is a good idea to do a nice little half updo, or if you have you know thin hair or a child that you wanna have a nice updo, this is a good option because it's smaller than the bigger one and it might look a little more natural. I tried the bigger one and I loved how it worked and it was so easy to use. So I'm definitely excited to try this one out. Let me know if you want a hair tutorial on how to use this. And last for hair accessories, I found these cute headbands. Comes with two and I really like how they look satiny and they don't have on the inside the comb type that like really digs into your scalp. I like these that are more gentle and I really like these colors. This is a really nice soft pink and this is a really pretty olive green. So definitely cute little hair accessories, two for a dollar. So the next items that I'm gonna show you are all in the office section slash school supply section. So I got myself a little green notebook. It's just a regular spiral notebook and it is lined paper. So I really like to have these little notebooks in my purse because you never know when you need a piece of paper to jot something down. And I'm that type of person that like I need to write everything down. So I love to have little notebooks in my purse and I love the color green. And next for supplies, I found these really cute colorful pens. I really like ballpoint pens. So I love that they had ballpoint pens in these colors because usually you find like the gel pens or ink pens and it's kind of hit or miss from the Dollar Tree. Sometimes they're like dry or they don't really work well. So I loved how these worked and I opened them already because I needed them for school. I'm that person that likes to write my class notes in color coded text. So these are really nice for me. I like having colorful pens and they write really nice. So just to give you an idea, purple is my favorite color. So just to give you an idea of how it writes, really smooth. I, I love when pens write smoothly. It's like so satisfying to have a nice writing pen. So definitely nice ballpoint pen. The next item was something that I was really excited to find and I kind of regret not getting more. This is a coupon holder and they had it in different colors, but I got the pink just because I thought it was pretty. It's like a book, so it's an envelope. You open it up and they have little slots here for you to put your coupons. It has a slot over here. Turn the page, it has another slot here and another slot on this side. And the last page comes out and it's a bigger slot. So I really like these for organizing my bills and you know just keeping organized with any little paperwork that you want to file so i really like this and like i said they had different colors so if i find more i think i'm gonna get more because this is actually a really convenient little filing system and i can see this you know going easily in my purse or something if i need a coupon or you know just to put receipts away so this was something that made me really happy to find. And the last item in supplies is another item that I got so excited to find. So this right here is a stationary set. They had so many different kinds. And again, I kind of regret not getting more because I figured out what I wanna use this for and now I need to go back and get myself all the different styles. So I got myself the green because I love the color green and the paper was just really pretty. So I'm gonna open it up and show it to you so you can see the envelopes and the paper. But how cute is this? And the little envelope is so cute. They had the green, they had purple, pink, I saw blue. So I think I'm gonna definitely go back to get more because I realized what this stationery set is perfect for. So I'm gonna let you know now, a little spoiler alert on what this is for and how it pertains 
to my future giveaways on this channel. So I'm gonna open this up and let's take out the paper. So the paper sheets are really cute. They have a flower detail on the top and bottom on some lined paper. You only get a few papers, you only get four. So it's a cute little set. You also get these beautiful little cards with the same flower pattern. You open it up and it's empty. So you can write your own personalized note and then um, the back is blank as well. And then these are the envelopes. And I like that the envelopes are green and already pre-lined so that you can write you know, the address is down and you just have to stamp them yourself. So, not to digress from the Dollar Tree haul, but I wanna give a little insight on what I plan on doing for future giveaways. So the way this little stationery set plays in is that I'm thinking, you know, I love giving back as far as a giveaway, but what better way to really appreciate the budget babe way, if not shopping for your own items. So I was thinking for the next few giveaways, I'm gonna be giving out gift cards instead of actual items. So they will be going in beautiful stationery and I will just mail it out to you. So that's how this ties into our future giveaway. And I hope you guys like that idea. So let me know in the comments if you like the ideas of my giveaways being gift cards so that you can shop for yourself. So let's get back into our haul. Next, I'm gonna share with you the makeup items that I got on this visit. So if you've seen any of my previous Dollar Tree hauls, you've seen that I've found a lot of the products by Broadway Colors. So I was so excited to find a new Broadway Colors product. This is an eyebrow pencil. The color is dark brown and it has its own sharpener on the top, which I love. It's a really nice pencil and it has a spoolie end. So this is definitely, definitely a very convenient and really nice size for an eyebrow pencil. Super excited to try this one out. Next product that I found is a Carmex. I love Carmex for my lips. So I was really excited to find this at Dollar Tree. Full size of Carmex. And this is a legit brand. Usually I find like a generic Carmex type of brand. So I was really excited to find this. And last in makeup that I wanna share with you is another Wet n Wild makeup product. You've seen in my previous hauls, I go crazy over the Wet n Wild products that I find. So this is a good one because I've tried this product before and I really wanted to share it with you. This is the Mega Cushion Foundation. I love this product because cushion foundation just goes on so light and nice on the skin and it leaves you really airbrushed looking. So this was a great find. It has SPF 15 so it does feel like skincare. Super nice and I really like that it already comes with a nice sponge applicator. So everything that you need for foundation is right here. You don't need a brush, you need a sponge. It has the applicator right here and it goes on like a cloud. So really excited. If you ever see this at your Dollar Tree, definitely stock up. So we've reached the end of the Dollar Tree haul. I hope you enjoyed all the products that I showed you. As always, don't forget to share, like, comment, and subscribe. Also keep in mind that I upload every Tuesday and Friday. Tuesday videos are budget babe videos and Fridays are fabulous Friday videos. So if you don't want to miss out on any of those, be sure to hit the bell so that you can get notifications every time I upload. I thank you guys so much for joining me on today's video and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Bye.